Welcome back. Well, this morning we are live with a local author and artist, Janice, Janet Toll and Dusty Scott. They both worked on the children's book, Silas the Great House Cat, and have come to tell us all about it. Good morning. Thank you morning. for having us. Absolutely glad to have you both here. So can you give me a little background about the book and its history? Well, it, it's based on a real event from last Halloween. And it just were some regular people at a wonderful big mansion in Galesburg called the Great House. And it was Halloween mm -hmm. night and a little kitten, uh, probably six months old, I'd say, uh -huh. wandered into the house and he was kind of hungry and so forth. And everyone said, well, he's such a nice cat. He, you know, he should, maybe we should feed him and let him stay for the night. Uh -huh. And so began the story. And it's the story of, uh, from the perspective of the little cat. And it teaches uh, about feelings, uh, kindness, and courage, and uh, it's it's uh, kind of has a lot going locally. We have local people that posed yes. for the uh, uh, people in the book for the artist, and the artist is Dusty Scott, and yes. he was the one, and we used the local models for him. Very nice. And what yeah. was that process like? You know, really just you know putting your creations and an imagination into the book. What was that process sure. like for you? It was really interesting because I, I typically paint oil and acrylics and uh -huh. do, uh, I do do a lot of portraits and stuff but uh, um, this was kind of a unique thing because it was going to be like 14 of all one so I told Janet I'd really like to paint it as like kind of all one painting and paint them at the same time and it was just really unique because most of the time I do like one ofs of different things and not so much a 14 you know painting <laughs> series so it, it was it was very interesting so yeah it was, it was, it was a lot of fun and my daughter got to be in the book which was uh, as one of the models so that's, that's <laughs> yeah. really exciting. Yeah, so I bet that was special. Yes absolutely yeah. Very good yeah. so as an author, what would you say to a local author who's maybe looking to get started? And I'll ask the same for you as an artist. Sure. That's a really good question because really I don't feel like an author. <laughs> I, I wrote a 600 page book with, you know, rhymes, very gentle, sweet story. Mm -hmm. And I think a lot of us can really do this kind of thing. And so it was just going ahead and pushing through it and um, making it happen. So I feel like a publisher yes. and I learned how to publish as well. So it was a big learning curve for me and I would encourage anyone to do that. And luckily, you know, with all the local, the local house, the local artists, the, uh, the local children and adults, the cat is real. Yes, you know, I think cool. um, anyone, even in, you know, Peoria could do such a thing in a matter of six months or eight months. And there's ways, in, and, and anybody is welcome to contact me, of course. I'd be glad to give them some tips on how I did it. Very nice. Yes. And, and what would you say? Uh, I would just say, you know, it's just been a, you know, as far as like because I do so many other different things like with art uh, this was just such a fun unique experience and it's just kind of a, another avenue to kind of broaden opportunities and, and uh, you know and then kind of going back resorting back to your childlike you know it was just so fun to, to yes. think about what I would like as a, as a child and what my daughter would like and, and uh, it, it just like I said it was uh, pretty relaxing and pretty enjoyable so very yeah. good. Well, before we go, we run out of time here. Could you oh, tell okay. us how people can get the book? I know there's an upcoming book signing. We have that information right. there. And, and there's uh, just get your books in the usual way, wherever you shop for books. And uh -huh. uh, of course, you go to your local independent bookstore. <laughs> and I'll be at I Know You Like a Book October 22nd. All right. Yes. Very good. Well, Janet and Dusty, thank you so much for joining us this thank morning. Thank you very much. Okay. Thanks. And we will share all of these details on our website, ciproud.com.